In the course of Brexit, the German-British relationship cools down significantly. Not least because of the Ukraine war, the two states could now come closer again. That's at least what experts suspect. However, there will still be some points of contention. According to experts, the relationship between Berlin and London, which has been severely strained by the Brexit uh, quarrels, is on the mend, not least because of the war in Ukraine. When Chancellor Olaf Scholz was received by British Prime Minister Johnson in Downing Street, the focus was more on the uniting than dividing, and uh, that's also what German historian Helene von Bismarck expected before the visit. This appalling war is in some ways an opportunity for an improvement in relations between the UK and Europe, and also Germany, said the Britain expert. While there is no guarantee that the damage caused by years of Brexit strife can be repaired overnight, there is a way forward that was unforeseeable until recently. She is therefore cautiously hopeful that the relationship will relax and that there will be pragmatic cooperation on a case-by-case -case basis. Before Scholz's visit, British government circles said that the crisis in Ukraine had caused the bilateral talks to go into turbo gear. Contacts with the EU have also been intensified. In the eyes of the British, Germany and Europe expert Alexander Clarkson, who teaches at King's College London, it is also helpful that the importance of Brexit as a domestic political issue in Great Britain is increasingly disappearing. This also gives hope for an improvement in the relationship. He said, I think the idea of Brexit mobilizing large layers of voters in British politics is on the wane, and that means it's becoming more of a technical issue. Well, the issue of Brexit is closely linked to the personality of Boris Johnson, who does not have much room to maneuver due to his relatively weak position in his own party. But behind the scenes, there's already a bipartisan consensus that points to a much more pragmatic relationship with the EU in a post-Johnson era. That's what Clarkson believes. And that is already noticeable now, he says. Despite Johnson's urge to make a name for himself, Von Bismarck warns that the British Prime Minister's commitment to Ukraine should not be dismissed as political theater. Johnson has successfully established himself as a driving force in Europe when it comes to arms sales to Ukraine's and sanctions against Moscow. And there I disagree with her, by the way. In her opinion, the British are now concerned with persuading Germany to do more with a charm offensive. However, according to the historian, there will be still points of contention for example on the question of the Northern Ireland Protocol. And London will probably continue to try to undermine the agreement still. And uh, there I once again agree with her, because it might look at the moment, because the Ukraine war is covering everything else, that there is improvement, that this British government might go easy on the Brexit part. But point one is the people have not forgotten. There are still a lot of people who see the disadvantages of Brexit and they want changes. On the other hand, this government, whenever it needs it, will take out the Brexit card again, will hit on Northern Ireland and the protocol if they need it for domestic reasons. That is something we learned over the past years and that will not change. In the in the, in the good case that the Ukraine war would stop very soon, the whole thing would come up again because Boris Johnson was, it's, it's cynical, but he was lucky. First the pandemic, now the Ukraine war that was covering up everything else. But if we come back to a situation very soon where this is not the case, then the all those covered problems will come back to the surface and then it's getting interesting and I'm quite sure as long as Johnson is there and this government is there they will use their old tactics again and so I'm not as optimistic as von Bismarck I'm sorry and I'll see you in my next video bis gleich